My name is David Nebel and I'm a physicist and copywriter. We're in the frigid but interesting Mad Dog Garage in Portland, Oregon. My Oreo separator machine is entirely based on the dislike of cream and preference for cookie. It goes by OSM, it's just an acronym. Here's the little on-off switch that I made out of some scraps of aluminum. One of the hardest things to overcome was to um, learn how to build robots and make them work, but it was also difficult to um, keep my hands warm and the back of my neck warm. It not only makes me cold to sit here and work on it all day and night, but it makes the cookies cold and that makes the cream more difficult to separate from the cookie. This is where the Oreo actually starts on the machine. You just place one here. This arm grabs the Oreo and it places it over here. I don't have a catchphrase for my machine, but I guess if it did have one, it could be something like, let's get that cream out of there, or like, uh, this cream's no good, get it off the cookies or something. Then these two panels flip up and get it ready for the first real important process the um, division process. I've been working on my machine now for about uh, 0.4 years. Wait, 0.04 years. I used um, tools and wires and wood and uh, a lot of aluminum and motors. The division process is carried out by this hatchet, which lowers down right through the center of the Oreo. And then I've got this floss to kind of keep the creamy Oreo halves from sticking to the hatchet blade. The, I, it was a big time commitment to build the machine. I had to work some long hours. I didn't get to see my girlfriend or my dog for hours at a time sometimes. And I had to try to find like a good sandwich in this part of the city and stuff. There were a lot of sacrifices, I guess. Then these arms will come down to receive the two Oreo halves and then bring them over here to um, this little tray. And then the tray clamps the Oreos down and holds them and gets them ready for the next step, which is the CNC router table that's gonna take the cream off of the cookie halves. I'll power it up now and we can give it a try. Two clean, delicious Oreos. Mmm. Yum.